So the history of, of how Leavenworth became a Bavarian town uh, backs to uh, when really the economy was, was dying. Uh, we had come out of being a lumber town and uh, really just atrophied down to the point where the folks that were here were really, really struggling. So two fellows here, Ted Price and Bob Rogers, and they went to Bavaria and the ladies here in town, they was uh, wanting to make the town grow and so they wanted to put uh, cowboy town and so these two guys over in Bavaria they stayed and looked and then they came back and uh, they said no 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 this is more like Bavaria than it does a cowboy town. So my name is Jordan Brown, I'm general manager of the NZN uh, here in Leavenworth. The Johnson family uh, designed and built the Enzian, um, began building about in 1982. So as the town of Leavenworth began to change into a Bavarian theme, uh, Bob Johnson uh, lived here and he was integral in that uh, development of that theme. So as that process went along, uh, Rob and his son uh, Bob uh, were builders and they had trade skills and uh, their wives uh, had very skills and they saw what was happening in town and they thought, you know, can we do this? Can we, can we build a hotel? And the four of them put their skills and their minds together and came up with a design. And Rob and Bob uh, built the hotel. And uh, for the early years, uh, well, many of the early years, they ran it as a family. 25 years ago, the average experience was different than it is for those today. Uh, so for those today, uh, it's actually a fun, unique experience because what we see is now the third generation coming on in. So we're seeing the children that were here uh, 25 years ago bringing their families in. So I'm having conversations with those folks as they come in and they say, well, you know, I was here back when Bob used to play the outpour and up on that deck. And so they recant those stories. So what we've tried to do here at the Enzian is make it a family friendly hotel. Um, but over the last uh, 15 to 20 years, Bob's role has been more of an ambassador for the hotel. Uh, he's here every day playing the Alphorn and uh, interacting with our guests. And so as the guests come on in, uh, one of the first things they want to know is, uh, when is the Alphorn concert? Because maybe they've seen it or they've heard about it. Uh, and then the next question is, well, will Bob be here? Because as the years have gone on, he's taken a little bit more time away. Okay, well, my name is Robert E. Johnson. By going to go to Bavaria and see what they do, well, they, I used to play a trumpet when I was in high school, and uh, we heard these horns play. So anyway, I said, well, well, maybe I can make one of those. Well, I talked to the guy over in Europe. I says, well, how much do those things cost? And and they were way ahead. And he says, he says, well, I can't speak very good English, and you can't speak German, so. Uh, he says, well, he says, you give me a check for that and then I put it in the bank, then, then you can have them, I'll ship them. Uh, I sold my part to my son and so he got a good buy. <laughs> and anyway, uh, I, I think the theme is great and it's been good and so I play my horn for my living. <laughs> but he gives me breakfast. <laughs>